It's always entertaining to watch someone dismantle a triggered feminist. If you don't know, I am Sam, the Simp Saver. Subscribe. Okay, so what I'm trying to say is you're saying the law favours mm -hmm. men more than women. I'm saying it actually favours women. The only reason I'm saying this is because, number one, the whole thing saying about rape, I'm saying that a man is uh, guilty until proven innocent. A woman, if you actually go look at a lot uh, of cases, a lot of women have said, you know, there was this case of this black guy. She said, you know, he raped me. 15 years he spent in prison. After 15 years, he was innocent. So he yeah. wasted 15 years. Number, my second point is that um, abortion, if a woman decides she wants to get an abortion, but the man says, I don't want to take care of the child, that can't run because he has to pay child support. He's yeah, but you both, step, you both stepped into what you did. Okay, but, you she, but, okay, but she says, I can, if she says, I want to abort the child, right. boom. Uh, and then, he wants to keep the child. Okay, yeah, okay, but let me switch it then. Let's right. say if she wants to keep the child, mm -hmm. okay, but he says, I don't want to. Mm -hmm. He still has to pay child support. Yeah, he does. Why? Because he's he's equal in the action that they both did. So at the start. okay, so then she, if she wants to abort the baby, yeah. why can't he have a say in that as well? Because it's it mentally affects the woman com completely. So, way more okay, so women the have the advantage then. It's no, more fucked to men. No, no. It is but more about the mental effects of paying child support. He has oh, to go out there and the mental effects about, about, you then you know, If you're telling me that men are more assertive, you should be working and getting your pay. You're getting okay, then don't have pay. sex then. What? If you yeah, that's a man's decision as well. You're telling me that a man and a woman are, it's not 50 50. It should be a joint decision. Unless the man's raping the woman or the woman's raping the woman. It should be some. I agree that women have more of a say in abortion. Mm -hmm. I think that's calm. It's your body, but why does he have to pay child support? Because, uh, because uh, you, 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 you had sex at the end of the day. Then you had sex too, why are you aborting it? Ooh, he got you, got you there. He got you there. It's true. Look, look, look. I, 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 hold up, hold up. I agree. No, 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 no. no. Listen, listen, listen. Look. look, I agree with abortion when it comes to rape and a sexual assault. I'm abortion should be allowed, yeah. But I'm just saying, if you two decided, okay, you're gonna have sex, you are at risk of having a child, mm -hmm. right? So. As we're saying, it favours women because no matter what the choice woman makes, the man is still fucked over either way because he can't say don't get an abortion mm -hmm. because then she'll be like, my body, my choice. If she And if she doesn't get an abortion and has the child but he wants the abortion, then she has to pay, he has to pay child support, okay? Right. So that's the abortion thing. I was the other thing I said, I was abortion, divorce. 63% okay. yeah. of divorces are initiated by women, why? Money. Because the man probably treats her like shit. No, because the no, no, and I'll tell you why. Because women benefit from divorce. Fifty percent. That's why divorce was put in place. Yes, to benefit women. Because women have been put down too much. No, 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 no. Why did he say in the beginning that because the law doesn't favor the law doesn't favor okay, women? No, okay, okay, I, I, okay. Now you see. So now the law favors women. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, now you don't have Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. No, It was it was nice being at Queen Mary's. We have now. The, way, the law favours women now, not as in the way, it's just only... So why the fuck does feminism feminism exist then? Yeah. yeah. Feminism, has been made, feminism has been put in these laws. The liberal uh, the liberal wave made... Okay, but feminism the now. Feminism place. was about equality, yeah? Yeah, I'm feminism, talking about feminism now has now. Been, been corrupted and fucked. Yes, oh, I, yeah, I agree yeah. Yeah. that oh, yeah. feminism now is, is fucked. That's why okay. I wouldn't align myself with many feminist views. But so men and women are not equal under the law then? Because it favours women. Because you, cause you just said that. Feminism. You just said no. Feminism. Okay, favors is the, is a complete just just the wrong word to say. What's the right Supports word? women. <laughs> gotcha, bitch. She was starting the back pedal at the end there. But listen, a lot of people know nowadays that guys just get effed over in a lot of realms of life. The women benefit from a lot of realms in life. That's just the way it is. Us men, we know that. A lot of women are starting to agree with it, but a lot of them don't because they know it's true. And we know the truth hurts. And women's kryptonite is accountability. I'm just curious, like, what's your body count? Mm, I, knew this I don't know. I, I'm not keeping track. Plus or, plus or minus 10? Under 10, more than 10? Uh, I don't know. I literally don't know. Like, I, I don't keep track. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure. Bueller? Plus 10. Plus 10? Okay. Yeah. Plus 20? No. No. Oh, okay. Excuse me. Between ten and twenty. Okay. Four. Twenty-nine. Okay. Um. So because I go to church and uh, I'm in mass, I like um, I view intimacy as like kissing, oral, you, you and you don't have to. If you don't want to say, you don't. No, need, I want to. You don't need to give him. He's asking about vaginal intercourse. He's asking about vaginal intercourse. Yeah. I'm like. I'm like. I. I include like people on my body count that I've like, kissed yeah, and all of that. No, 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 so no, penetrative no. sex, yes, eleven yes, yes, people. Yes, eleven okay. people. Okay, yes. okay. Mike, what about you? Man, we ain't going here. Okay. <laughs> hey, no, I'm a man of God. I'm a man of God. 
I thought it didn't matter. I thought body count didn't matter. But they're all running laps around each other to not answer the question. I'd rather go for a six, seven, or an eight instead of these really, really fucking hot girls. Cause bro, I'm telling you, these girls are yachts every day. Flying around the world, free flights. Fucking, you ain't getting on a jet without sucking dick. You think these billionaires is bringing these girls on there so they can take photos? You know how to cook? I don't. I'm not gonna cook for no man. Exactly. No, but what like, the f I look like, I look like your mom? Hell no. Nah. Exactly. Kind of, kind of. Kind of. I'm like, my mom's pretty though. But what? A woman who can't cook is like the equivalent of her asking a guy, can you drive? We've all been there, guys. When you ain't driving, you ain't getting no b So if a woman can't cook, man, see you later. When it comes to dating and relationships, who is typically seen as the prize, the man or the Me, woman? Bitch. Yeah, the woman. So if the woman is the prize, why even bother going out with a man in the first place? I don't know. <gasps> That's, That's a, a good great question. question. The, the woman. woman. So who's the prize in a lesbian relationship, both of them? Both of them. Yeah, yeah. yeah, oh God. Both be the prize. So then why aren't they both the prize in a heterosexual relationship? Men are yeah. I was about to say men are down here and women are up here. Yeah. Okay, so, so are women equal to men or are women superior to men? For sure, superior. Superior. Okay, so then why do women go around saying they want equality when they actually want superiority? It's just for the look. So people just want to be like, oh, I'm going to go look for this, but they're actually looking okay. for Okay, why is it, do you know what the definition of chauvinism is? Chauvinism it means one sex thinking they're superior to another. Why is it when men think they're superior, we call it chauvinism, but when women think they're superior, we call it feminism? That's a great that's, question. That's, yeah, that's a good question. Got me stumped there. Yeah. Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like most relationships only should last a total of two years. Nothing extra. I feel like after two years, you got to renew it. Go that's what I said. Do something new. Do something different. Kind of come to the table. Because like, if you don't know what you want by that out, time. Yeah. Two years. What like, are we doing? Yeah. Are we getting married or not? And what? getting married is kind of uh, like. Yeah. So every two like years, it. you every guys have years. to. Wait, hold on, time out. Two, every, Renew it. Yeah, uh, every or two. it's over with. Because, like, really, the best phase in every relationship is what? The honeymoon phase? Right. What are the first two years? After that, I, I know what you're going to do. I know all your sex moves. You're going to do the same exact move every night. Right? Like, it's just the same thing over and over again. I right, feel like cheating is two essential. Years. You can learn. I agree. I'm all for cheating. cheating. What? No, I Oh, right. my. All right. All right, like, all right, break this down. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we've been I waiting agree. on. I disagree. I, I would never be in a relationship again where I'm just, I spent most of my life in a relationship. I don't want to. You know, and I'm my mother did it. I'm doing it like I was with a relationship, and then when I was done with that one, I didn't talk to him. I didn't communicate. I felt a new boo, and once my me and my new boo was locked in, then I'm like, I'm done with you, and then I kept going like that. Wait till this woman hits 38, 39, 40. You're gonna see a video of her crying on your page on TikTok, talking about I need a man. I brought all the bullshit. You know how they go. You we've seen them all before. You wait until that wall comes creeping up. Hey, welcome to heaven. Can I get your uh, name? Of course you're a man. I'm sorry? God's a man. Explains a lot. Oh, actually I'm not. I just choose forms. See, look, now I'm a woman. Yeah, hold, hold on one second. Yellow. Hey, Satan, how's everything going? Terrible. I love it. What can I do for you? So I have this one terrible person who, for some reason, got sent up to me, and I think you'd really hate this person. Okay, okay. I hate to hear that. Tell me a little about it. Well, him. actually, it's a her. Oh, no. No, 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 no. What? Is it that feminist Yeah, how'd you know? I don't f***ing want her. That's why I sent her up to you. But she's terrible. I know. I can't f***ing stand it. I thought you loved terrible people. I do, but holy f***. Is she awful? I mean, God, I got some pretty terrible people down here, but at least they know they're terrible. She's convinced she's a good person. She's totally delusional. Yeah, so what do we do with her? Well, there's only one thing we can do with her. Hey, so, uh, good news. You're not actually dead, so we're gonna go ahead and send you back. <laughs> she just got sent to the gulag. Maybe up there they've got a feminist ward where they put all these people. I don't know how it works. When these women reach a certain age, all that feminist stuff goes out the window anyway. So they got time. So when you are twerking, when you're shimmying, you are literally releasing trauma, releasing stored emotions from your hips. When you're bending your knees, you're crouching on the floor, you're connecting to earth, you're connecting to the womb, you're restoring your energy. As I was doing this, I was healing myself through all of these generations of collective trauma. And I realized that twerking truly is a spiritual practice. <laughs> <laughs> I 
This might be the biggest load of shit I've ever seen on my whole YouTube career. This clip right here is the biggest load of bollocks I've ever heard. 